What's up guys? Nate Dog FPV here. Today we're going to be taking a look at the drone drop. So I just recently subscribed to drone drop guys. I've been a quad box subscriber for probably almost a year now. Uh, I've been pretty happy with their boxes most of the time. Uh, you get some good parts with quad box, some good uh, props. They throw a t-shirt in their box, uh, which is cool. Uh, usually a pretty cool shirt, like I'm wearing one right now, for example, the Cheap Pass Motor shirt. Um, so again, guys, I've been pretty happy with quad box. Uh, I've got some quads that kind of need some work right now, need some rebuilding done. So I uh, figured, hey, why not subscribe to Drone Drop? You know, I've seen some of their recent uh, boxes, and it looks like they've been doing some pretty good stuff. So I figured, why not give them a shot? So yeah, we've got the Drone Drop. This will be the August 2018 Drone Drop, guys. Uh, so yeah, I figured I'd open it up with you guys, let you uh, check it out, see what's inside. Again, this is my first drone drop, so I haven't even opened the box yet, so we'll open it together, see what's inside. But yeah, hope you guys enjoy, and we'll throw this thing on the bench and take a look. Alright guys, so here we go. We're going to open up the 2018 drone drop. Got my handy dandy scissors here. So we are going to cut the sticker, or tape, or whatever you want to call it. All right, got that. Let's set our scissors over to the side. So let's see, it says drone drop, drone drop.com. So let's open it up, guys. All right. So first things first, we've got some HQ props. These are green, obviously. I'm trying to see the size for you guys. Um, might have to take it out of the package to actually see the size so they're definitely v1s i'm gonna guess they're like five by 4.5 maybe no five by 5.1 by 3.1 by three okay so that's definitely different uh never had the 5.1s or the 3.1 so definitely some i've never tried before they feel pretty Pretty solid, pretty, pretty durable, so we'll give them a shot. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see it. These are also the ones that actually will go on the motors that have the uh, just the little balls that hold them on so you don't have to use a uh, nut on the top. I can see it's got the little slots for those. Uh, but yeah, so some green HQ V1S props, 5.1 by 3.1 by 3. Uh, yep, and then you can see yeah, it's the uh, Popo Quick Swap. All right, so we'll set those to the side, guys. We've got one bag of those. We've got a second bag of those. And we have a third bag of those. So we've got three bags of props. All right, let's see what this is. We've got a HQ prop battery strap. Uh, there's actually two of them in here, guys. So battery straps are pretty handy, pretty useful. Um, I definitely have plenty of battery straps in use and break them pretty often, so... Uh, good to have. So yeah, two battery straps. What else do we have? We have a SanDisk Micro SDHC US UHS-1 card. So this is a 16 gigabyte SD card. Um, and yeah, guys, and that's actually pretty awesome. Uh, I've actually been uh, have a need for an extra SD card right now. Uh, I actually have one in a split, uh, run cam split that went in the water, a 32 gig card uh, that actually bit the dust when it went in the water. So I've been needing to pick one up to replace that guy. So yeah, this 16 gig card should be uh, good for sure. Looks like it's one of the uh, higher speed cards too, uh, which I haven't even tried one of these yet. So yeah, stoked on that guys. Um, yeah, so 16 gig SanDisk uh, SD card. Okay. And we've got a tool. So this is a Team Black Sheet 1.5 millimeter hex driver. Um, has a cap. That's cool. <laughs> I don't know if you guys have ever seen any of the quad box videos, but lots of the quad box tools never have a cap on these, and people complain about that. I really don't care. It doesn't matter to me as long as it works. It works. But yeah, so 1.5 millimeter hex driver, um, which I've got several of these, but you know, kind of building up a collection of them now. But they come in handy. I kind of put these in different toolboxes, um, like one in my drone box, one in my regular toolbox, and stuff like that. So not bad at all. All right, guys, we have a uh, what is this? Brain FPV. Yeah, guys. So we have a Brain FPV hat. 
Um, looks like a pretty nice hat. I like the design. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see this real well. But yeah, that is the design. So that's a quad with a brain. With the brain um, FPV logo on the side here. And it's a snapback hat. So honestly, guys, I'm, I do wear hats all the time. Well, not all the time, but I wear hats a lot. Uh, not a big fan of the snapback. I prefer uh, fitted hats. But still a pretty cool hat. I'll probably wear it and get some use out of it. Uh, so yeah, it looks pretty nice. Looks, I mean, definitely looks like a good quality hat, like it was made well. They even have the uh, plastic insert in there to kind of hold the shape of it. Uh, but yeah, pretty nice looking hat, guys. So happy with that. Uh, we'll drag our box back down. All right, then we've got something on here that says FPV camera. And that's all it says. So let's open that up. Okay, so there's some kind of camera in here. Don't know what kind, but... All right, so this is a FPV camera. So it looks like a like a Foxy or Pro camera or a Foxy or Aero Pro, one of the small micro cameras. Um, but yeah, it just says FPV camera. So I don't really see an actual brand on the uh, box or anything like that. So that's a little different. Um, included, we've got a couple of wires. So it looks like it can do, um, yeah, so we got 536 volt ground video, then your ground OSD control. Um, yeah. So I'm not familiar with this particular camera, guys. We'll have to uh, do some research on it or do some digging on it, see what's what with it. Uh, but yeah, maybe useful. We'll have to check it out and see. So it comes with some wires there, and we've got uh, just a little quality control pass thing for it. So yeah, um, again, not sure what kind of camera this is exactly, but I'll try to look it up online and grab a price for it and throw that uh, in the video for you guys. So FPV camera, what else do we have? Uh, we've got some Team Black Sheep stickers. So Team Black Sheep Serious Toys, a bunch of different Black Sheep stickers. We've got some more stickers. Uh, super tech, super tech, drone drop. It's a pretty cool super tech sticker right there with a the flight controller and form one ESC. That looks pretty cool. Uh, so yeah, stickers, and that is it, guys. So we've got our stickers, we've got our FPV camera, we've got our drone drop hat, uh, we've got our SD card, we've got our tool, we've got our battery straps, and we've got three sets of props. Um, so all in all guys, um, I'm pretty happy with this box. I mean the props look good Definitely get some use out of the props. Definitely like the SD card um, Definitely like the tool battery straps are good um, I'm kind of on the fence about the hat guys um, I mean, I, I like the design of the hat, but again, I'm not a big uh, fan of snapback hat So I honestly don't know how much I'll wear it um, In the drone drop they typically don't do clothing items or hats or anything like that you know usually it's all about quad parts or tools and stuff uh, which is one thing i was kind of looking forward to with them um, but yeah this month they decided to do a hat so it is what it is but yeah overall guys i'm happy with the box so again i'll grab some prices for these items and throw them up on the video as we're kind of going through them uh, but yeah, if you guys let me know what you think about uh, this drone drop what you think about it overall just uh, feel free to leave a comment uh, yeah, guys, please subscribe and um, like the video if you enjoyed it. And we'll see you on the next one.